now in this video my goal is to give you a controversial morning routine that nobody talks about um just for some credibility yesterday i made 2.5k lifetime value from two clients basically so just so you know i'm not like one of these like self-improvement youtubers that are just sitting there in their room telling you how to how to become successful as they're like not even making money right so yeah bro the morning routine that helps you make money is not because this is what i used to do right i used to wake up meditate go outside take a cold shower all these different things sometimes i would even read or like do some push-ups or any anything like that right but what i realized is that my morning routine took me literally 30 to 45 minutes to do whilst on the other hand i also realized that my mornings are always the most productive things so this was very controversial to me i was like wait my mornings are the most productive but i'm also spending 45 minutes on it B to basically doing tests that don't even matter to m to like it's not the 20% that gives 80% of results, right? So then I changed it up. And I was watching a couple of videos from Ryan Doris about how to get into a flow state. And he told me that the first 90 seconds of your day, you should be working. So you wake up and you should be working the first 90 seconds of the day. So I started applying that shit and I basically started waking up at 7.15, which I always do. Um, instead of meditation, cold showers, all the bullshit, I just started working. And I just started working for like three hours straight. Um, I can tell you, bro, I've, I've been in a flow state every single time. 100% of the times. So, what do I do after that? Well, after that, after the three hours of work, then I do the meditation stuff, the cold shower stuff, the outside stuff, all that. I, I basically take a break of like one hour. Because you know when in fitness people always say like, ah, you don't have under recovery. Or sorry, you don't have overtraining, you only have under recovery. I feel like it's the same in business, it's the same with your with your mental state. So it's, yeah bro, you have, you have of course the physical strength but you have mental strength as well i think it's the same it works the same so after this one hour of like cold shower meditation all that stuff i just work three hours again and i always get into a flow state these three hours why because i'm not checking my phone i'm not doing all the email checking notifications all that stuff you know you know the things that that you shouldn't be doing right so i think the reason this is so powerful, the reason, of course, is like you can work six hours instead of four hours in a row right now. But which is, uh, by the way, it's all flow state, it's all deep work. But also, I think every time you take a break and the break is boring, your dopamine your basically your dopamine baseline goes up right it's the same for every for every action there's an up there's an equal and opposite force um you know when you do the bad habits your baseline goes up and then it goes down when you're doing like when you're taking cold showers your baseline basically just goes up, up of dopamine so you like your work more so you're more likely to do it over and over and over again but also when you're meditating this is just a theory that I have read, but when you're meditating, I think your baseline goes a little bit lower because it's like, it's boring, you don't really like it, but then it goes up after that because for every action, there's an, there's an equal and opposite force. So, yeah, bro, I think that that's the power of boring breaks as well. Um, I think cold showers are very powerful too nature is very powerful to recover so those are the three things that i do in my like one hour break basically sometimes i just stare at a wall and just think about things that i i could implement in my business and how i could make more money but yeah bro i think
if you apply this shit, I think it's the most powerful morning routine that you can ever fucking try. So basically, you wake up three hours of deep work, then you have a boring break to increase your dopamine, and then you have three hours of deep work again. Then you eat. Simple. Then you check your messages. You do you do all the stuff that you're supposed to do, right? But you have six hours of deep work. That's crazy, bro. So if you happen to be a coach that wants to monetize and scale their coaching business, just send me a message or... Uh, so I mean, like, I, I've got a link to book a call below in the description. So uh, click on the link right right now, and I'll see you in the call, bro. We'll talk about how to scale your coaching business to the motherfucking moon, right?